Hi, my name is Mia Nistico. I am 37 years old and I am a woman's tri-fitness competitor. I wanted to create a reality-based TV show on the workings that actually go behind becoming a fitness competitor and also want to inspire and motivate women. Many women who look at someone who is a fitness competitor and they think, oh, I can't do that. I don't have a dance background or a gymnastics background or a cheerleading background. Well, that's my story as well. I don't have that kind of background. I've had to learn gymnastics and dance as well as train so that I could compete. An average day consists of waking up at 5 a.m., eating my first meal, and making it to the 6 a.m. spin class. Then there's all the food prep to make the meals that will fuel your body throughout the day. I have to eat specific foods every two to three hours, so I have to carry around my meals with me, as well as all my shoes, my gear, my, my JC Sportswear workout clothes, all that stuff so that I'm supported through running, jumping, dancing, all of that. The Women's Tri-Fitness Competition is not a bodybuilding show, it is a fitness show. It's an overall athleticism. I mean, you have to be agile, you have to be quick. And yes, you have to have a nice shape, but it's geared towards a more feminine shape, not, not a bodybuilding shape. The first thing that we do is the obstacle course. It consists of a 10-foot rope wall that you have to climb up and jump down off of. Then you have the rope grids, incline, decline, monkey bars, a 15-foot cargo net, you have a baton pass, you have hurdles that you have to jump over, you have a steeple box, you have bars that you have to dip under, and at the end, bars that you have to jump over, do somersaults, landing on a mat, pushing yourself off the mat over the finish line. This is the obstacle course, and that's just one part of the event. Then you have your fitness routine, which is a minute and a half to two minutes of a dance routine that has to consist of a number of flexibility moves and a number of strength moves as well. And this is just two out of six possible events that I compete in. So you really have to be an overall athlete, both mentally and physically. You're building your body up and you're tearing it down. It's really a unique sport like none other. And what I really want to do is just bring more attention and more awareness to it. Hi, my name is Mia, and I love Anthony's Runway 84, and this is Anthony. Don't forget Cold Fire Pizza. And the Cold Fire Pizza. When I want to cheat, on the cheat day, Cold Fire Pizza is the way to go. And Anthony here is gracious and wonderful enough to be one of my sponsors. And I very really proud. appreciate that. Thank you very much. Yes, thank you.